Before you judge someone else, remember that you have blind spots in your own life. Blind spots or attitudes or weakness that you can't see or refuse to see, even though they might cause conflict with others. For instance, you may be constantly argumentative and not realize you keep turning conversations into debates. Jesus says that when you feel the urge to judge someone because of their blind spots, think of it as an opportunity to uncover your own, and to address them. Jesus talked about this in the Sermon on the Mount. Why do you look at the speck of sawdust in your brother's eye and pay no attention to the plank in your own eye? He's saying, how dare you? Why are you so concerned about the sin in someone else's life when you haven't dealt with the even greater sin in your own life? Take care of your blind spots so that you will be able to see clearly and help others. Have you noticed that you tend to judge others on what you dislike in yourself? For example, if you know you're lazy and you don't like about yourself, you're likely to see it more in others and judge them. If you're prideful or greedy, you tend to spot that quickly in other people. Whatever you struggle with, you'll notice in others more easily. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians 11 verse 31, if we judged ourselves in the right way, God would not judge us. Think about what that verse is saying. If we would seriously examine our lives and self-evaluate our own weaknesses, faults, and failures. Instead of pointing them out in others, we would be prepared to stand before God in humility. God is for you, not against you. He already knows your blind spots, and He wants to help you resolve them so that you can mature in your faith. God bless you. Type. Amen. If you have faith and trust in God.